in today's video we will be discussing about a pocket pen which is called pilot kukuno so let's see how you will receive this pen so you will receive it in this type of box as you can see so this is how you will receive it it is a simple packing plastic packing uh, it means you don't get box with this pen because once you take it out from the box this plastic is generally of not of much use okay so you know there is a seal here and you have to open this seal and once you open this seal you can take your pen out like this so this is how you receive it a simple plastic uh, packaging so these are the two pilot kukunos which i am having and this is the box so this is the medium nib medium nib which i ordered and you know this is how actually nib nib looks like it has a it has a this smiley face engraved on the nib and maybe these are the different color options lot of color options are available uh, in this pen as you can see so many color options actually they are available and in the back side you can see something is written here so i think i took this from amazon and this color is called kakuno orange uh, blister pack mrp is 1100 rupees for this pen that is this one uh, but this is little bit costly uh, maybe because of a uh, different color it has a more elegant look uh, so this this black barrels will be slightly less costly and the white barrels are slightly more costly i don't know the exact reason but uh, i feel that these looks more elegant that is the only reason which i see these are some special editions um, i can means maybe and they are a little bit more costlier so mrp of these pens is around 800 uh, sorry uh, 1100 rupees as we saw in the box but uh, on amazon and du during discounts like uh, during uh, um, some festivals or some discount days you can find this pen this particular pen in approximately 750 800 850 rupees and this one is little bit costly so this is sky blue color and white uh, white barrel and you can get purple here you can get yellow here that is the the color of the cap will only change so you can get yellow cap you can get purple cap all those look very good so it is a pack a pocket pen small sized pen both are almost all the features of both the pens are same but this cost slightly lesser you will get it between 800 to 1100 depending upon whether you are getting some discounts or not or whether there some there are some shipping charges or not and this pen you will get approximately maybe 1100 1200 1300 like like that so sometimes 1400 also i have seen as i have seen on amazon so so this is this is the box and if i open the box so this is where the pen is there and uh, you also get uh, some documents so these are the different colors which are available and then inside you can simply see that uh, how to use the pen so how to, how to use the cap so first we have to take off the cap as written here and then we have to unscrew the barrel and we have to fit the cartridge and then we have to start writing so that is what's written in this documentation you'll get this documentation also so this is a pocket pen small size pen and as you can see that the cap does not uh, the the cap does not contains any clip the pens really look very elegant they are low budget pens uh, as i told you low budget in a sense that uh, compared to other uh, pilot fountain pens like pilot metropolitan and there are many other obviously much higher uh, ad, uh, uh, much advanced models so this is the this is the lower version this one and pilot petit which i have already made one video pilot petit which writes which also writes really well uh, so pilot petit uh, you get approximately 700 rupees in india and this you will get approximately 700 this one 700 800 900 and this one goes to 1200 so very good looking elegant pens introductory pens uh, maybe this is good for beginners 
and their pocket pens. So, length, length is uh, not uh, like a traditional fountain pen, it is slightly smaller. So, if I measure width cap, it is approximately approximately 13 approximately 13 centimeter if I measure with cap and without cap it is approximately 12.5. So, yeah it is approximately 12.5 and so to uncap it, it is simply on off. So, push out push in ok. So, uh, this is the mm, mechanism of uh, opening the cap and I uh, will be showing both the nibs that is fine and medium. So, uh, in this pen I have uh, I, I or, uh, while, or, while ordering this pen I ordered a medium nib and while ordering this I ordered fine nib that time. So, let us see what are the other features. So, pen is completely made up of plastic, but it is a very good plastic. So, I have some plastic pens and in fact, I saw uh, we, did, we, we saw uh, pilot pet it also in one of my previous videos. And uh, compared to pilot pet it, the plastic quality is very good here comparatively. It is a um, good quality plastic, it means even if you touch, you can feel that it is a very good uh, quality plastic. And they call it call it as pastel plastic because the, the color is as you can see uh, they, they are like pastel. So, the, the quality of plastic used is very good and on the pen as you can see on the cap the name of the brand that is pilot and the model Kukuno is engraved here. So, good looking pen and again in, the, in this also you can see that pilot that is the brand and Kukuno is engraved here. So, let us uncap the barrel and see its features completely made of plastic and this is a hexagonal the whole body and the cap is hexagonal. So, mm, the uh, the bottom of the barrel that is the, the grip area that is also like very good uh, it is uh, triangular. So, when you when you uh, uh, so the gripping is very easy means uh, even if you use it for the first time uh, you will not uh, need much adjustment. So, gripping I, I felt that gripping is very easy because of the triangular uh, gripping section and uh, this this body is hexagonal. So, that also it means if you will Mm, if you like if I put the cap then because of the hexagonal so section it, it is it, it, it can be easy it is, it is uh, rolling it can be kept rolling like this. So, that is because of the hexagonal section. So, uh, the, the nib is completely made up of steel stainless steel as you can see and since this is a medium nib if you can see m is written here and then there is a smiley face. I do not know whether you can clearly see it or not, but I think maybe if you can see it has a smiley face. So, this smiley face actually assures that uh, the nib is in the proper uh, orientation, ok. You are using the nib mm, in proper orientation. So, this is a stainless steel iridium nib as you can see and the cap is hexagonal, the whole body is hexagonal and the grip section is triangular. So, it is naturally you will be uh, you, uh, naturally you will be adjusting with the pen, it will not take much time to adjust it. It is it is a uh, pocket pen if I if I want to compare the its length with other pocket pens. So, I have this uh, Kevico fountain pen and then this pilot pet it. So, compared to these two pocket pen which are very small, uh, Pilot Kukuno is not that small, but if I compare it with like Twisby it is slightly small. So, Kukuno is, is uh, the length is less than Twisby Eco and it is almost similar to Parker Vector, almost similar to Parker Vector. So, Parker Vector most of those who are using Parker Vector the length is approximately same. This is the only um, this is cartridge only pen no uh, no converter. I think you can use converter, but converter does not comes with the pen. Mm, st some standard pilot converters can be used with it, I am not very sure, but the pen does not comes with converter. It is uh, it comes with only cartridge. So, let us see how it writes. Mm, I think mm, I, I hope that you got all the information about its features and now let us uncap it. 
so the barrel as i told you is hexagonal and completely plastic so this is the cartridge which which i got with the pen actually i got black cartridge i think yeah i got black cartridge but since i had blue cartridge with me so i inserted blue cartridge in this i think the ink is already over i think ink in this pen is already over and i have used this pen last i think 4 5 months so i am reviewing it after using it for 4 5 months uh 4 5 months and uh, the pen is good i will recommend this pen if if you are if you like pocket pens uh, i will recommend this pens so this is the this is the fine nib this is the fine nib as you can see uh okay so let me focus on the nib yeah so this is the fine nib now you can see and the smiley uh, engraved also on the nib it is stainless steel and so this is the cartridge which i got with the pen black cartridge and now i think we can see that how these pens right so first i'll be demonstrating the medium nib pen and then i'll be demonstrating the fine nib so this is what all i have written here uh, these are these are some um, important features of this pen uh, and whatever whatever i have written here is from pilot kupuno only medium nib so this is medium nib it's very smooth though i like the nib of pilot pet it more it was very wet it was very smooth but this is also not no, very good means i recommend it this is also very smooth and it dries up quickly as you can see it dries up quickly it dries up quickly so it is a smooth writer nice pen nice pen now let us take the fine nib i'll have to change the cartridge i think so you'll get this type of cartridge with this pen and so you'll get this type of cartridge and that has to be fitted here in the pen yeah so you have to just fit it and little bit push it from here so it's gets fitted and now let us write with this nib i'm not sure whether it will write immediately let me press little bit i'm pressing the cartridge now let's see whether it's right or not yeah so this is fine nib and i think you can see the difference Fi those who like fine nib uh, this is also smooth it's not scratchy or mm, like uh, some fine nibs are this is also very smooth as you can see so if those who write uh, who like fine nibs this is a good option a good and dry pen dry nib so both the nibs are very good medium as well as fine these two are my favorite fountain pens i like them i use them regularly along with my all fountain pens means uh, all the fountain pens which i like so these are always in my collection in which i use regularly so i think uh, we have ended today if you like this video please comment and please subscribe my channel if you feel if you felt that any other information was required to be given please uh, write in the comment box so that i'll take care in the next video thank you very much